I won. We will be clean and healthy. Also, I won more leafla for the death or even to check the timetable what the better right. And I won more people come and work cleaning, not lazy people throwing the bin. Right, my name is Daniel Bull and some of you may have heard of me, some of you may have not. And but the first topic we're going to be talking about is be healthy and, what, and, what, and how it can affect the world. And one of the ways you can be healthy is home cooked meals instead of ready made meals like you would get in the supermarket. And you could also have keeping fit by exercise programs, especially of course if you're too young to go on a diet like most women would nowadays. Staying home all day is not healthy. That's what I tend to do. So don't pick up that habit. Spend some time and socialize. And social skills is one of the vital skills that you need, especially for the young autistic person or anyone with learning difficulties. Since parents find it hard to deal with kids with autism or learning difficulties, that's why I suggested more respite. But they'll all be to do with the social effects and just to do with the people. Economic effects is money and environmental on what will happen to the land and what, and what have you. Enough money to live on. Parents should be able to stay at home if they want to because they might take better care of the, their children. People should be able to write the the films the, themselves. Young people could help their parents or do something they always wanted to do, like their hobby. Finding Cardiff a great place to live all let young people know what's going on. You could do this by Facebook, text, email. And second thing is the, the transport. Like there's no on the buses, there's no passenger lifts at a central station, prams, and where's the where wheelchair users go? There's always prams there, so tr prams are always blocking wheelchair users, and that's about it. To be the best. I can be meet friends on my own, more clubs, more freedom to to take risks, information that is clear and explains how to complain. Treated with respect and included. What makes it better? If people were nicer, people to learn sign language more pictures and easy language so everyone can understand people to know more about disability more good images of disabled people doing things getting treated is like your age and not younger schools need more accessible accessible Familiarity, audio script, subtitles. Welcome back. The second thing we're going to be talking about is safe to feel safe. Are you with me? And, it's, and I warn you, it's not for the screamish. Keep safe online or anywhere. Very important, especially online because you don't know who you're talking to all the time. And here's one thing you must never ever do. Give away too much information because they will want your bank details and they'll steal your money in a couple of minutes. And never tell them where you're gonna go, like going to work for six weeks because what are they gonna do in those six weeks? Invade the house in six weeks! And also, be careful who you interact with. You may think a person's famous, but I personally think they're real and others think they're fake. But I've met a few on Facebook and they are real. And also, none of that now. 
We'll teach ch we should also teach children, especially learning difficulty children, how to use a phone. Like, in an emergency, we'll call 999 or 101. Those apply in the UK. 911, however, is applied in the US. And another thing, in school, any children can get bullied, especially children with difficulties. So when bullied, always tell a teacher, don't use violence as a last resort. Because violence doesn't really do anything. You, th you think you're all big now, you get those tough guys who are crying. Also, in the parks, where people are most vulnerable, park wardens should be, should be occurring. And also, unfortunate that most people with, people with learning difficulties don't get jobs. Which is why I thought work experience would be a good thing. Like, other, like all children, some, of them, some children with learning difficulties get tag along staff. And I would go for three because they may be really difficult and require two and one may be ill. And read and ascribe for, you've got one read and one scribe as a mains and two backup in case the two are ill. And also there should be a youth club to improve your social skills. Anything like that. That's it. Oh, <laughs>